treat, we're going to take our Newsies Batman Origami Kit and use it to make this double pyramid bat computer phone stand. It's super easy. I happen to be a fan of Batman, so I'm going to use Batman paper, but you can use whatever you want. Now, make sure to start off, you want to flip it over. Then, you're going to fold it exactly in half, just like this. Make sure you line the edges up as best you can. Doesn't have to be perfect though, best you can do. Then crease that nice and firm, so you get a nice fold. Now you're going to flip it over again and unfold it. Notice you have that nice tight crease right there. Now we're going to take the bottom and fold it to meet that middle crease. Not all the way covering it up, just meeting it and saying hello. Again, nice and firm little crease. Then you're going to flip it over, do the same thing with this end. Make it meet, say hello, and then nice and firm crease. Now you have it folded just like this, right? So now you're going to flip it over again. Poor Batman, he's getting kind of dizzy. We're going to fold it this way again, end to end, nothing super crazy, and a nice and firm crease. Now that it's turned our rectangle into two nice little squares. Now we're going to take these squares and make them triangles. You're going to take this end and fold it to meet the middle. That's pretty much all this is. Lots of folding and meeting in the middle. Then nice and firm crease, unfold, and turn around. Now you're going to take this end and fold it to meet the middle. And nice firm crease. Now you'll see that that square has turned into an X. Okay, you're going to do the same thing on this end because it wants to be just like its little friend over there. So you're going to fold that meet nice firm crease, flip around, do the same thing. Meet in the middle, nice firm crease. Now you have two lovely little exits. That's the basis of our pyramid for the iPhone stand. So last step here, you'll notice each side has these two little wings that wanna stick up, very Batman-like. Now, you wanna fold these little wings in, just like this, so that they're hiding, making a nice little V on each end, okay? Just like that. Now do the same thing on this end, folding it in, making a nice little V. Sorry Batman, you're going to hide. And there you go. Now, the only tricky part, not too tricky, we're going to turn these little X's into pyramids. The way to do that, take that, see how it naturally wants to do that? You're going to fold that in and use these little V's we made as flaps that'll hold that in place. And now you have your first of the double pyramids. Which again, helps to make a nice little firm crease there so it holds its shape. Now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Again, it naturally wants to do that. So you're gonna get your flap ready and fold it in. Fold that under, give it a nice good little squeeze and crease that middle again. And ta-da, you have a handy-dandy Batman phone stand. Happy Halloween!